Alrighty, guys and gals, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Misty Mountain Gaming Channel. I'm Big E. This is uh, City Skyline Season Number Two. This is the beautiful area of Copper Creek. We've got a view of our Copper Creek Regional Airport, also known as CCR. Some of my older subscribers probably know what that means. Anyway, I think we solved the airport issue. Let's take a look here. This is going to despawn. I like the look of this plane. This is going to despawn. I've been watching the planes here. I don't understand this at all. I don't know if it's just part of how this works. However, I was trying to figure out... Uh, let's get out of this view. So if we go to airport information, before this was completely outgoing, now it looks like it's balancing out here. This actually was a lot different when I just looked at it. But we do have planes incoming and outgoing now, which I feel like is good. So maybe I have figured out what was going on. Um, you going to get that trash, bro? <laughs> That's a garbage truck. Why did he not? Uh... I don't know why he didn't pick that up. So um, anyway, I think I've solved that. And all I did is I changed. And I still don't know that I have it set up correctly. One of these is incoming, one of these is outgoing. It seemed to change the numbers a little bit. One of my subscribers, Rise, giving me some points and tips. I'm just not absorbing the information. I appreciate your help, my friend. I do. I'm just not absorbing the information. Anyway, it looks like it might be okay. I just really dislike how the planes spawn here, and when they come in, they despawn. It's not pleasing to look at. But obviously, these are the people that got off of that plane, so... It's working. Anyway, this episode, I need to pause because I broke some roads here. So I went to upgrade these because we had dirt roads in here, but they were just way too slow. However, when I was trying to upgrade them, it was telling me that the slopes were too steep and they were really, really steep. Steep, even. Um, So we're going to fix this. We're doing two things this episode. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to fix this nonsense. We got to, these switchbacks have to be a bit better. That was way too much of a steep slope. The other thing we're going to do, let me, let me do this. So hold on, twist the map so that right here. What I think I'm going to do this episode, we're going to create a massive, maybe like a coastal edge right here. I'm going to terraform this, this big section here. And we're going to fill it with water. Maybe it's a gigantic lake. Maybe it's an ocean. But we're going to create a coastal town over here with some shipping lanes. Because shipping, I don't think shipping will work in these little small, we'll call this a river. These river systems here. Sometimes they will, but I don't think they're wide enough for it to work. So we're going to create our own deal have a whole separate community down here, and then I might get creative and tie some of these waterways together and see if I can maybe set up a ferry or a passenger system. That's that's the plan. I want to do something a little bit different. Anyway, for right now, let's see about fixing this. So I'm gonna, we're gonna redo this. I'm gonna take this road all the way back down here. We're gonna redo this, the, the whole thing. I'm gonna redo it. I was a little bit hasty putting it in, and there was no need to be hasty, none at all. Let's remove some trees, let's take this up. We'll put these trees back in uh, once we get everything sorted out here. I can take this up as well. I love this tool. This is the forest brush tool. Also, wait, 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 wait. I had a mod that I downloaded it's not working. Let me check something really quick. One of my favorite City Skylines builders is a guy named Imperial Jedi. I've been watching that guy for a very, very long time. He he kind of got away from YouTube and he's, he's just like a streamer now, but he's actually putting City Skyline videos back onto YouTube. He'll never see my channel, but uh, I, I've been watching that guy for a long, long time. And he had an add-on in one of his new series. Can I find this thing? right here I think I can make this I have no idea what this is 
I think we... Oh, this isn't actually working. He has different options than I do. Maybe I've got to do that. It's just going to break my game. I may have the wrong map. I mean, the wrong mod. He's got a, a mod that um, puts, like, clouds in the sky. What is this song? <laughs> I don't know what's going on over there. But uh, uh, apparently I didn't use the the mod right. Okay, we'll bypass that. Hopefully what I've done here... Let me change this back to vanilla because I don't... I don't think I've done this right. I think I missed something I was supposed to have. But it puts clouds in the sky. It's kind of neat. Anyway, let's get on this. Um, I can actually... We'll take it. We'll unpause it. This is a self-contained community up here. We don't actually need a road in here if we don't want to. I don't think we need a road. Because we have commercial. We have it self-sustained. They have everything they need up here, I think. But let's put the road back anyway, so... What are we going to do? Let's use our slope tool. Let's see if we can do better here. Let's get rid of this. Um, let's take this down. That's fine. I'll take the strength down a tad bit here. So I want to come from up here. Let's see if we can make this a little bit less crazy looking. It's still steep as fuck, isn't it? It really is. Okay, so we've got to... I've got to create some more switchbacks here, I think. This is a bit of a problem. So how I can do this... How can I do this? Maybe we can come... I'm not the best at switchbacks. I am not. Let's do this. Let me level... Let me see if I can create my... This is what I did the first time. It just didn't work very well. Let me just create some plateaus here. Not really even sure what I'm doing. I'm just kind of winging it right now. Okay, say, cool. We see that. We see the wingage happening. Um, let me think about how this road wants to snake up. Maybe I should start from the bottom up. I think what I probably need to do, this probably, this side of the mountain, I need switch back, so we're going to come up this way. But then I think we need to start snaking. I, th I, th I know what I need to do. We need to snake this way. Because there's not enough room here. Does that make sense? Kind of makes sense. It might make sense. So that means I need to broaden this out a little bit. I know this is terrible looking, but I'm going to fix this. I need This needs to be broader this way. And we'll see if, we'll see if we can make this better. But more gooder. We're going to make it goodlier. Okay, that's what I meant to say is goodlier. We're going to make it more gooder. Most gooder. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is horrible. So now what I can do here. Let me get this road... Up. I feel like I need something over here. I'm just going to put this road back in. I honestly don't feel like we need it, but we're going to do it anyway. So let's run. We need the, I want the um, freeform tool. I'm just going to come up and around. Get rid of the trees. Just move, just move these for now. There we go. Very nice. Let's come back this way. And this is going to come... So before I put the road in, let me do this. This is one of the problems I was having before. We're going to use the slope tool. Well, we need to take this down to just about road. A little, little wider than road length here. Moderate strength. So I want to come... This is going to come up this way. I can smooth that out. From here, I'm gonna gradually fade this in here. We'll smooth all that nonsense out, don't you worry. So come up around that way, I think it's okay. This needs to be fixed, it's not a problem. So we're gonna come from here. I'm gonna grab it from here. We're gonna come around this way. 
right around to Funky Town. This is too much. I need another level. Maybe I can make this work. Maybe I can make this work. I'm going to grab it from here. Let's see if this will actually work here. Let's... Oh boy, what the hell am I doing? I don't know what happened there. That's not okay. <laughs> can I? I can reset that. Let's definitely reset it. This is too much. This is way too much. What about a tunnel? I could do a tunnel. Let's bring this out around this way. I'm not good at tunnels. I'll, I will say that right now. I am terrible at tunnels. I could also do this. Let's create another ledge here. Probably not the best way to do this. In fact, I'm sure of it. But that needs to be split. That's too much there. And now that's too much. And then this is going to be too much. We'll, we'll get it. We'll make this work. We can make this work, bros. And broettes. Again, my female viewers love when I call them broettes. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Bring that out a little bit. Like that. All right. See, maybe we can make this work. This is how it needs to be right here. Okay, so back to the slope tool, which is here. Uh, 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 uh. So we're going to come from here, this height to, let's try it right here. What does that do for me? Does that, doesn't I do, yikes. Okay, this height, we need it way, it needs to be much more gradually sloped. I see the problem. Oh, man. Nope. Try again. Here to here. Son of a bitch. It keeps rolling over to that side. It's okay. We can smooth it. I'm just going to leave it how it is. And I'll fix that. We'll fix all this. I think we can make this work. Um... I'll fix it. We can fix that. Um, so it comes up this way, and now the road needs to come. It's going to come from this side. To here. Okay. It's terrible here. Okay, let's redo this. Okay, I'll fix that complete nonsense right there. In fact, let's fix it right now. Take this down, grab this. Okay, now I now I have a ledge there to soften. Back to this. Increase the brush size a smidgen, a smidgeroony. I'm gonna come from here to here. Oh no, wrong thing, slope tool. Come from here to here. I'm going to come up this way. I'm kind of, it's not really, um, you can see I'm cutting in a little bit, but that's actually, that's okay. I think we can make this work still. I'll just make my own. So from here, you go from the highest to the lowest. This will come around this way. We'll fix that. I've driven a road like this before, and they, uh, they're fun, but they're also a little bit nauseating. <laughs> um, wait, so we set it here, and I want to come from here. We'll come up this way, getting a little bit shorter. And then we need to get back up here. So we're going to come from this height. i got to get rid of this fence. I was looking at this fence, and... Um, when I was doing the editing on the last video, there are some places where this fence is horrible looking. Let's we'll see if we can fix that. Like over here, it's wonky as hell. I, do, I don't like the way that it turned out. Okay, so from the highest point, which is in here, so we're gonna come, we'll come from like, we'll do this. Okay, 
Now I can probably put my road back in and then we'll do some softening. I know that looks crazy, but that's kind of what you have to do. That's what you see. Now, here is the test. Can I, can I tie all this together here? Um, we're going to use the whole point of this. The whole reason this happened is because I was upgrading the road. Because I was watching trucks come up this road and they were just hella slow. So we want to do the freeform tool. I'm going to turn all my guidelines off. I don't know that it matters with the freeform tool, but I'm going to come out this way. I'm going to come down the hill here. We're going to roll up this way. Try to get a... That's fucking terrible. <laughs> Try this again here. Try this again. Um, use my picker to select the road. Come down this way. And come down this way. Come down here, around. Uh, um, well, this would be a, a nice wider turn right here. Gotta get those road, those trees out of the way. Cause you can see anarchy, what it does. This is a nice gradual slope down here. I hate that angle. What is anarchy? I could, is it shift P? Anarchy is off. Let's do that. Anarchy needs to be off for this. Come around this way. I don't know what the hell that song was. <laughs> I was just trying to ignore it. Okay, I, we're going to... Definitely change up the playlist. I am not feeling this at all. Come down this way. Probably a much better way to lay these roads in. Should take this tree out. Well, I guess it did wasn't actually in the way, maybe. Uh-huh. We'll come around this way. Get down through here. This will come to Funky Town. Uh, I can fix that. I can soften that. I want this to curve around. I hate this song. <laughs> what is the playlist here? I don't know. All right, and I can fix that. Let's fix this right now. Um, move it tool. I think if I hold left alt down here, yeah, I can straighten that out. Okay. Okay, what does that look like? It's not terrible. It's also not great. I don't know. That feels all right. Now I feel like I need to upgrade all these roads and hopefully I can without any issues. I guess I've just decided to do it. Yeah, this is where you, okay. I think I can use move it to get around that because it's so close. Oh man, there's, there's a, we have a lot of problems in here because of, uh, cause I plopped these buildings in. Maybe the most annoying song I've ever heard in my life. Nah, no way. Not even close. It's going to be up there in the top 20, though. Okay. Terrible. <laughs> okay. So, what do we have here? I think it's not letting me upgrade be twofold. One, because of the park we have here. But I think I can... Well, I know what I can do. Let's just move this. I'll move it to the outside here. Temporarily, I'm going to put it... Where would it fit? Is it going to fit back here? Slope too steep. 
surely it'll fit in there. I'm going to put it right here. Which, which should allow me to upgrade that, that, and that. What do we have going on here? Oh, parking lot. Let me move this parking lot. This was holding me off here, I think. Both of the parking lots are in the way. Kind of sucks because there's people using these. You know what? Right there, bro. You guys are now awesome. You're super awesome way over there now. And what is this? I don't know what that was. A little corner shop or something? I'd have to move all of this stuff. <laughs> do I care? I do care a little bit. I want to get this right. Let's move this. I like seeing these parking lots being used. I'll tell you that. We're just going to move this guy over here in front. I'm going to have to move that again, though, right? Because I want to upgrade that road as well. Just do them gradually like this. Or I could leave that dirt. I could leave. Maybe I'll just leave this a dirt road. This, like, old Main Street deal here. I don't think I have a problem with that. Let's leave it. Let's leave it. Trucks are using it. It's a long way down. <laughs> It is a long way down. Let's put our trees back in here. We should have our um yeah, we've got a we've got our own tree brush set up here. We we'll just throw some trees back. Let's take the brush strength down some. Yeah, throwing some trees. And then we'll soften. I should have softened first, but no big deal. Go to the soften tool. I want a giant brush for this and low strength, I think. This is what I want. I'm just going to kind of run over it really quick like this. Soften up some of these hard edges. Okay. Super, super, super dangerous. <laughs> you know what we would need here? Do I have... Let's use our find it tool. Do I have guardrails? Um, I do have guardrails. This is exactly what I want. Except I don't want that. Let's put some guardrails in here. And let's do the straight tool. Let me see. See if I can make this work. Uh, no, I want this. I want freeform tool. What the hell? <laughs> I must have... Clearly, I chose the wrong thing there. Let's do this. Double side cross cross barrier. Yeah, that sounds good. Um, Guidelines off. Guidelines off. Yeah, I think this... Yeah, this is what I want. This is exactly what I want. A little bit of realism right here, right? I feel like you would definitely have guardrail there because that is death <laughs> probably actually need the guardrail the whole way it's a little bit of work i don't know if i mind a little bit of work no i don't want to move it i want to pick it i want to pick it let's do it let's just do it i'll run this down i might do a little fast forward bit right here will i remember to do a fast forward bit i seriously doubt it I'm not going to look. <laughs> Let's go over here. We are going to put 
Oh, I can't actually. I've got to do it from this angle. Okay, this is interesting. This is the air. So this is the edge of the map you're not supposed to see. I have like, um, <laughs> I have fog disabled. What in the hell? These are spawn points in the game. I really, if there's ever um, a city skylines too, no doubt they'll probably change this. Um, is that going to be a problem for what I want to do here? I think what I'm going to do is we'll just take... I think I'm just going to work around this area. Let's. We're going to pretend like it's not there. We can move this. I'm pretty sure I can move it, but we're not going to worry about it for right now. Anyway, I want a large brush here. We're going to lower this by left click. We're going to Alt-Z. Boy, what did I just do there? Oh my goodness, dude. What in the hell? Fix that. Okay. Uh, this tool. Take the strength down a little bit. We're going to right click to lower the terrain. It looks like that's as far down as... Is that really as far down as I can shrink that? Interesting. Okay. We're going to pull all this down. This is going to be our coastline. We're going to have a little... going to make our own waterway with our own connection here. So it would be different... Uh, different variations of how far the beach comes out. And how far do we want to bring this over? I'm not sure. Also, do I want to... Let me see. I don't want it... I don't... I don't want it too crazy, but I do feel like I would like to see a little bit of ocean right here. So we're going to bring it a little further out on this side. May, may change this. Let's increase that strength so it's a little, we're a bit more efficient here. All right, I think I'm feeling that. Let's fill this with water. Yeah, it didn't get very deep. And I have a feeling that's because I leveled this whole map. So I must have leveled it. It must have been a lot uh, lower than I thought it was. And when I leveled everything, I almost brought it down to as low as it will go. So that's kind of a problem, I, I think. Uh, we need to get rid of some trees. And let's take this way up. Let's do this. Let's get rid of all these trees. Again, one of the reasons I absolutely love this forest brush thing. So before I got into mobs, when I was placing trees, dude, I would literally click one at a time. <laughs> Clicking, putting a forest in or a forested area, I was clicking one at a time. It was ridiculous. All right, we're going to bring this pretty far back here. Because this is going to be, uh, we're going to make our own little beach here. I think we can do that. I think I went far enough. All right. Let's put some water in here. Place water source. I don't know if this is going to work. I, I think I'm going to have to put multiple sources in here. Okay. I cannot. This is something I have struggled with with this thing. says just the handle I like there's not a fucking handle here I place it place it there we go this is what I want I doubt that's going to fill all this in yeah this is a little bit unfortunate I might have to bring this whole area up a little bit because it's basically, that's just a shallow lake bed. There's no way that's going to fill all of that, is it? I'm going to triple speed here. I think if I use this, this raised sea level thing, I'm pretty sure this affects all of the rivers in here. Now what I could do is save the game. I'm going to save the game here.
Yeah, I'm going to save here. Just in case I destroy everything. I don't want to destroy everything. Let's see how this water works out. So if I do this, the sea level... Did that just affect everything? I did. I don't know if you can see what happened there. I raised everything. Is this going to be a massive problem? I don't mind the water higher like that. I think I affected it. I definitely did. But it might not be a problem. That, I mean, that filled it in nicely. I guess that's what I needed to do there. Okay, I guess that works, actually. So, do I need this water source in here now, since I just did this adjust sea level thing? The plane is still working. We're just never going to... We're not going to look at this. I think I can drag this down here, but I'm just going to leave it for now. The, also, the other problem I see, we're right on the edge of the map, so I can't, um, I can't really get the best. Well, I guess it's not too bad. I'll say the the camera position doesn't rotate very far out that way. Okay, you know what's going to happen right now? I am not. <laughs> we're going to go back to the trusted, tried and true. We're just going to do some jazz. Because this, it's a little bit too much. All right, well, let's even out. Or not even out. Let's do a little bit of, let's adjust this a little bit. I want a nice, well, I don't want the beach the whole way, I guess, do I? No, I don't want the beach the whole way. This is going to be the beach community down here. This, I'm just going to leave. We'll probably put some rocks or something down there. This is going to be our little beach community area. So let's create a beach. What are we doing on time? Uh, 36, about 36 minutes in. Let me see if I can remember how to do this. There's a way to create beaches, probably multiple ways. One of the ways that I have seen people do it is they'll drag just below the waterline and they'll create a shelf just below the waterline like this. Create a little shelf. And then we're going to do the same thing above the waterline. Stay a little bit deep here and we'll get a nice, try to get a nice long beach. And we'll take it down. Take it down to somewhere. I think right in here feels good. We'll end it right in here. Let me make sure all this is. Okay. So now what we do, well, what I think we do is we'll click up here and we'll flatten all this. And then we're going to smooth or slope. I think either one will work. Slope act, the slope tool actually might work better. We'll see. We'll see how it works out. Probably, I could have probably made the, uh, the brush size a little bit bigger, but let's see what happens here. So now if I use the, this tool, I'm going to come a little bit higher up. I think I can tie these together. I think the slope tool is the way to go. Let me do this small section here, and then I'll try the slope tool on the other side. And then we can paint this with sand. As long... Yeah, here we go. This works. As long as the slope isn't too steep, however, that beach isn't quite... Not quite as long as I want it, but we can just roll it back up this way. Okay, we'll just stick with this then. This is actually the smoothing. This is working. We'll just do this. Let's take the strength up a smidgen. Make this a little bit. A little bit better.
And again, probably many ways to do this, but this is, I saw somebody do it this way and it seemed to work really well. Create those two different levels and then you just smooth between them. And we'll kind of end the beach there and then we can paint in the rest of this. I keep hitting that key. And you can paint below the waterline to give the illusion of, you know, shallow water or whatever. Yeah, this is one of the problems I'm going to have over here is the camera is going to back out. Or just, you know, it's going to stop rather, not back out. And if your slope is too steep, you'll get this brown. You won't get the nice white beach. So you probably have to work with your work with your slope a little bit to get it how you want it. But I want I do want a big a big a broad beach here. Can't can't actually get it to the edge. This is where the some of the cloud stuff would be. And uh, let me see. Let me turn that back on. Can I figure out how to do this? Um is it gameplay? Let me see if I can remember where this is at. It's probably is it in graphics? It might be in graphics. I don't think so. No, it's going to be in one of these. Boy, can I find this? <laughs> um. Oh, it might be in hide it. I want to. I'm hiding seagulls. Let me see what I have checked here. I'm hiding billboards. I'm hiding steam and smoke. I don't want to hide the edge of the map. Edge fog. Okay, so if I turn that off, so you can see what it does. It kind of blurs out the edge of the map, but it also you can't see that. I guess, do I want to leave it like that? I think I will. It kind of creates the illusion of like it gets deeper. It gets much, much deeper right there. Okay, so we got a little beach area up here. Kind of happening. I could bring this much further in. Now, the whole reason I was doing this was because I wanted a shipping lane. Here's the problem, though, right? I don't think there was a shipping lane on this map, So, but maybe I could put my own. Actually, can I do this? Can I? What if I do that? Does that create a shipping lane? I don't know. I see two buoys here. It might. I might have just... I might have done that. But now we can have a harbor in here, right? We'll have, like, cruise ships that possibly come in here. Let's see. This is something I've never used in the game before. So we've got Ferry Pier. That's kind of nice. A Ferry Depot. I'm looking for this. I'm looking for a harbor. This has to connect to a route. So I do see a route here. Hold on now. Hold on. Can I take this and delete it and lay it back in? Can I create my own route here? Maybe? I've never done this before. Let me put that in right there. No way this is how you do this, right? Connect to a route. I don't know how to do this. I don't know what I'm doing here. I think this... I'm supposed to tie these into something that's already there. I think I just drug it off the map. I don't think I'm... This is not how we're supposed to do it. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to delete that for now. I think there's a way I can do it. Can I... <laughs> yeah, let me get rid of this. I'll look up how to do it. Hopefully I can. If not, we can make it a dummy thing, right? We can make it a dummy um, harbor, harbor for now. I just kind of wanted to set it up that way. We should probably wrap it up pretty soon here. But that's what I want happening over here. And maybe I might bring this in a little bit. Um, maybe kind of cut this out. What about the other things? What about these fairy? What about the fairy pier? Now, this can just go in here, which is kind of cool. Let me just drop this in for a moment. Oh, that looks kind of nice. Oh, we're still... We don't need to be three speed. Let's do regular speed here. 
Okay, and I might be able to use move it to sync this down, page down, and just try to fix that. I feel like it needs to be a little bit closer to the water. That seems a little bit more realistic. Okay, and then I can just terraform that. Okay, well, we'll do some interesting things over here. I'll try to do some interesting things over here. Maybe just like a whole touristy area over here. Have some little boardwalks. Uh, maybe try to get that harbor set up. Not the cargo harbor, but, uh, you know, for people. And then maybe develop back here with some big condos or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm going to turn this off right now. So that the uh, we don't see the... It doesn't worry about power and water and all that good stuff. Anyway, we didn't really get a whole lot done. <laughs> but that happens. That does happen with this game. What have I got going on here? This is a double turning. Not This is not ideal how I... The, my lane mathematics here are not really set up correctly. That is a thing, and that's something I have not mastered in this game. Also, another problem here is this is essentially a one-way road. What I really need in here... I need something like this. But I don't think I can upgrade this without breaking. Yeah. Well. Oh, because of the parking lot. This is actually what this road needs to be. Because right now, this is one way with parking. And I don't actually want that. Oh, this, this, this does work. This is what this really needs to be. In fact, probably all of these. But I feel like this is sort of... I'm going to call this not an arterial... But maybe a collector. I may as well do that. Down in this. Let's just see if we can. So this lower section down here. Let's increase the traffic um, throughput ability here. All of these roads need to be upgraded. but And I can make this work if I move... It looks like the parking lot is in the way. I don't know that this this crematorium might be okay. But I think I can slide this. Can I move that? Let me see if this will work. Um I really wish that pop-up wasn't right in the on the screen like that. Now, can I upgrade? Yes, I can. And yes, I will. Now, this one, it's the parking lot and the path. I like, so it shows you in red what's in the way. Let's do the same thing here because I want to improve tra traffic through here. So I can use move it and I can slide this back and I can slide this connecting point. That should be okay. I can take this and we'll do the same thing. We'll bring this back. It's just about Funky Town. Not quite, not full on Funky Town but close. Now I can do this. Wait, why can't I? Is it the fence? There's a bus stop there. I can't have that. Maybe I can slide. Let me see if I can slide this hole. It might be this. Let me just slide this over. I don't know if this is the... Is this a firehouse? It is. I don't know if that's the best place for the firehouse, honestly. There we go. Okay. That might work a little bit better. And I can tell them... I can use the uh, traffic manager here and I can... What have I got going on here? Oh, I do not... What is happening here? I want that to be double turning. This, yeah, dude, you can totally turn right there. So I guess when I upgraded the road, it did a little bit of a little bit of wonkiness. Probably needs to be a light here. The problem I have with lights is it can really s cause massive things. Boy, did it? 
Okay, we just put lights all the way down here. I'm not a fan of traffic lights. I am not, but unfortunately, the way that the vanilla game handles it, when you put some of these new roads in, it just automatically creates a light. And I don't even want to... Do I want to... I do want to stop sign there. Yeah, I need to change all this. This is probably something I'm going to do off camera. Upgrade all these roads, get the traffic right. And I know there's a way to change roads really quickly with like a priority road. I'm just, I'm not real good about knowing how to do that. And this is a fucking problem over here now. Let me look at this node right here. What do we got going on? Let me make sure this, oh, I need that. What do we got going on? I want you, you can come here. You can come here, dedicated. You can go straight across. So traffic, I think the way traffic works is it'll change lanes at nodes, and that can sometimes be an issue. I think I can do this. Uh, is it this? No. I'm not sure what I'm what I'm doing here. Is it this? There's a way to remove nodes, and I I it looks like I'm not. Click that, bro. No, this isn't, that's not what I want. Is it this one? I don't know how to remove nodes. I'm not, I'm not like, I need a lot of more, uh, a lot of more. I need a lot more practice with, with mods. There's a way you can remove nodes. I don't even know if it would really help here, but I know that I'm pretty sure traffic will try to do lane adjustments at a node. All I was going to do is remove the nodes here to maybe possibly force them to get in a lane earlier. But I think we're going to leave this for now. But this looks like it might be a problem. This is one of the things I do enjoy about the game is trying to come up with solutions uh, to traffic problems. So one of the things I would do in the past, I would just create like a slip lane here for residents. They could avoid this. Maybe this would just be commercial trucks. I don't know. We'll see what happens there. We will see what happens. Let's do a little bit of this action. Let's fade me off the screen. It's going to mess that up and we'll do it again. <laughs> all righty we are gonna call it here thanks very much for hanging out with me everybody i appreciate the tick the, the tips that you guys are leaving me again i'm not somebody who absorbs information easily like i can read something obviously but i'm kind of somebody who learns from doing so a lot of this stuff a lot of the tips i'm getting i'll actually i'm just gonna have to play around with it and mess with it until i figure out how to work it out but i'm doing the best that i can Anyway, I'm excited. I'm excited about the new beach area over there. It's a completely different part of the city, of the area, I'll say. We're just going to move on, create a whole different community, and maybe tie them together. We'll see what happens. Anyway, thanks for hanging out. I do appreciate it. You guys and gals, take care. I will see you in a future episode. Peace. Peace.